Oh, hello. One of the most interesting sporting stories over the last few years has been the acquisition of Wrexham by Hollywood stars Ryan Reynolds and Rob... Um, McElhenney. 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 With Wrexham recently gaining promotion to League Two um, in the last week or so. But did you know that Wrexham is part of the territory of an ancient Celtic tribe of Northern Wales, known as the Cornoi? or however you may actually pronounce it. Who, amongst other things, formed a Roman military unit that went on to patrol part of Hadrian's Wall. This is the ancient Celtic and Gallo-Roman god, Cernunos, also known as Carnonos, which is where the Cornoi potentially gets his name from. Cernunos is a god that is usually depicted with antlers and sitting cross-legged, associated with stags, horned serpents, dogs and bulls. In Gaulish, an ancient Celtic language, the name Sornunos is rooted in the word Carnon, which means horn or antler. He is often depicted as wearing a torque, a neck ring associated with ancient Celtic cultures. Thus, the Cornoi may mean people of the horn, and this god may have been one they worshipped amongst many others. The first reference to this ancient Celtic tribe comes from Ptolemy, the Roman geographer in the 2nd century AD although they were probably far older than this. Very coarse pottery, which is associated with the production, um, transportation and storage of salt, has been found very close to Wrexham, just northeast of Wrexham, in a place called Poulton in Cheshire, potentially signalling that this ancient tribe was associated and involved in the salt trade. One of the main strongholds of this ancient Celtic tribe um, was at a hill called the Reckon, where they were known to have built a hill fort in modern day Shropshire in Western England. Confusingly, Carnoe is a name given to various tribes across ancient Britain, ancient British Isles, including in the northeast of Scotland, in Caithness, and also in Cornwall. But this Carnoe tribe, this ancient Celtic tribe that we are discussing, um, is known as the Carnoe Midlands tribe. All these various tribes across the British Isles, across Britannia, were probably slightly separate, although they may have all shared worship of the same god, um, a, a, go a Celtic god of the Celtic pantheon of gods. According to certain sources, a Roman military unit was also made up and recruited from this Cornoe tribe, and it was known as the Cohor Prima Cornivorum. Although the sources are a little thin, this Roman military unit is apparently the only recorded native British unit to ever serve in Britannia. Their name Cornivorum means of the Cornovi. This unit is thought to have served in the Pons Aulius or the Newcastle Roman Fort and served and patrolled part of the eastern section of Hadrian's Wall. Wrexham AFC isn't just a fascinating sporting story, it's the latest in a series of stories of that area. But what about the genetic history of Wales itself? To find out, please click here. Thanks for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell and tell your friends and family about this channel. For ways to support this channel, um, through Patreon, buymeacoffee.com and PayPal, all the links are in the description below. Thanks for all your support and thanks again for watching. I'll see you next time.